Hello. <laughs> I can't even. Uh, too much stuff going on on my desk right now. Welcome back to my channel. This is Abby with Abby Reviews. This is going to be my review and recap for uh, Bad Boys LA Season 1 Episode Number 8. Ignore the fact that my face is naked. And that I'm eating breakfast. And that it's kind of echoey in here because I'm in my new place. And I am waiting for um, new furniture, my new furniture to arrive. So, we just, we just going to thug it out in the echoey um, place. But, let's jump into the foolishness and see what happens. This is where the big fight is supposed to happen. So, like there has been 17 other fights. But, okay, we're going to see. Let's jump into it. Okay, so I just wanted to get caught up because I'm like 10 minutes in. Uh, it's the next day after Jonathan goes back to the hotel. And Kirion, Gutter, and, and, and Dylan um, are having a conversation um, about what had happened. And it was like, they're not with all of that. You come in out of nowhere and then all of a sudden somebody got to give up their room for you. Like, and you know, Bugs was like, I, not Bugs, that's not his name. Gotta, it's like, if you needed a place to lay down, you could have stayed in my room, you know, come on, friend, you can come in my room, whatever. But to try and force your way to take over somebody else's room is whack to them. And, but Kirion don't give two dams about Milan and his issues because they already on the outs. So, he's like, if he got to fight, he just got to fight for it. So, yeah, shenanigans. Now they're getting ready. So, it's the day of the party. And everybody's getting ready. Well, Anthony is doing, it looks like he's setting up for the party. So, we're going to see what happens. I don't know. Gutter K said he's going to be in the hot tub with a thumb on, making it do to do So, we're going to see what happens. <laughs> what? Okay, so uh, maybe I'm conf I'm lost in confusion. Okay, so they get to the party. Everybody's showing up. Winnie Stacks, the guy from the fashion show, shows up. William the baddest shows up. Anthony immediately has an issue. Like, this fat bitch, William the fattest, uh, show his stupid ass up here. Wah, wah, wah. I'm like, what the hell did he do to you? He just excused himself from y'all's situation. I don't understand. What's all the animosity, beloved? What is all the animosity? Oh, God, Jesus, fix it. And so, apparently, Anthony and, and William have been going back and forth on social media. So, uh, Winnie Stacks has a little come-to-Jesus meeting. He grabs everybody together. He was like, I just hate the fact that it happened at my event because it was a charity for kids and blah, blah, blah. And so... Um, Milan is like, I just want to sincerely apologize, boo doo boo You know, we've all, we we have chopped it up and we made up and stuff. And apparently he and, and Kirion had had a conversation, they're good now. And so, he, and Milan said, in that big spirit of ha one big happy family, I'm going to try and get um, Anthony and William to make up because they've been going back and forth about it on social media. I mean, it's been two days. Like, what could I... Okay. William been gone out the house for 48 hours. So, I don't understand. I'm, I'm confusion. The timeline is conf I'm I'm confusion. Like, there's that much animosity that quickly in a couple days? Like, okay. What, what do I know? And I thought that maybe it's... The only competition shows where you can't have access to like your phones and social media while you film it. I don't know. We're gonna see. Darrell is such an instigator. <laughs> he is such an instigator, a fight coordinator, a fight facilitator. It's a lot. Why? Why, sir? Why is you well, keep, keep like, oh no, get that hole, get that hole. And then you, this, ugh, he got so much misplaced energy, sir. What are you doing? What is you doing? 
William then got pushed into the pool and Anthony is really acting like he did something where he just walked him back into the pool. And he's like, now drink that hoe. You ain't even, it's not like he punched him and he landed in the pool. Okay. All right. Okay, so it makes more sense now. So here's what happened. Uh, apparently, this is this was in the works like before, six months before the show started. Uh, where Anthony and William were communicating about being on the show. And it was like, oh, did you get your call from Black Natalie? She's really doing the show, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I got my call. Did you get your call? Blah, 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 blah. And Anthony was like, oh, uh, I can't wait to meet you. We're going to be friends. La, la, la. All of those things. And apparently Anthony was doing that and screenshotted their conversation to send it to the higher ups at Zeus to say, that um, to make it seem like William was talking out of turn already before the show even got started. Um, like, if I don't know if any NDA had been signed at that point to where if you, this is all in the hush hush, you know, you gotta, these things, like, until we announce who the cast is and da 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 da, then you can start talking about, oh, you're gonna be on the show. But until then, nobody's supposed to say anything to anybody, just keep it on the hush, blah, 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 blah. blah. And so I assume that William is, was trying to get him put off the show before the show even got started by saying, oh, he's already talking about he's on the show, blah, 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 blah. This is why William was pissed with Anthony because he was communicating with him like he was a friend when really he was just trying to be underhanded and sneaky and get him put off the show before the show even got started, which is some bitch shit, but okay. I understand why when Milan was like, can we kumbaya and just, you know, it be whatever, William was like, fuck that hoe, wop, 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 and they got walked backwards into a pool. But nobody knows this information yet except Milan because Milan was in the room with William trying to figure out why would you want to fight him when he was willing to apologize to you? Because he was saying he was going to apologize and say he was sorry you know, for they, so they can have a big kumbaya moment. William was like, nah, fuck you, bitch. Bop, 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 upside your head. So, and everybody else is bigging up Anthony, not knowing the imp the impetus for why William did what he did. Yeah, the foolishness. Now, the rest of these children who don't know the backstory of to why what's happening is happening is doing the absolute most when the least will do. Gutter, as much as I love you, what, what are you, do? why are you trying to fight somebody? Why is you trying to fight somebody? Calm down. Nobody's even talking to you, beloved. What is all this fever for no reason? Okay. Let me shut up. Because why do I don't understand why Gutter is acting the way he's acting. It's unnecessary. It's over the top. It's unruly. It's un. It's again. Did I say it's unnecessary? It's unnecessary. Do you hear me? Unnecessary. I don't know why that baby's acting the way he's acting, but it's really just you doing a lot for no reason. For no reason whatsoever. Um. Like, you got a lot going on, Sugarfoot. And I don't get it. I don't get it at all. But I guess we're going to see what happens. We're going to see. William has. Darrell was like, you came, you did what you wanted to do, you got beat up. Now, everything is everything, and just make it out of the party safely and get back to doing what you're doing. Meanwhile, in his confession, calling him every better bitch and punk ass hoe and all them other things that he doing. Now, um, this is my skin prep. This is what I do, all the stuff that I do before I put on the makeup. Um, Now, Rio has, has arrived at the party. Rio is Milan's friend. And Milan, after having 
this in-depth conversation with um what's the boy William and then having a conversation with Gutta and talking Gutta off the ledge. Um now they he he got Rio and he in his confession talk about I really don't trust none of these motherfuckers in here and blah 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 woo It's a lot. It's a whole darn lot. But we're gonna see what happens, y'all. Cause I think this is the beginning of the issue where um Jonathan and Rio have their altercation. But we gonna see what happens. And yes, when I tell y'all all my prep work is done, this is what I'm talking about. All of the oils and potions and moisturizers and things that I do to my face prior to putting on a drop of makeup, primer, or anything. All of that goes onto my face because I'm old and good skincare is a must. Okay, let's jump back into it. Okay, so here's the situation. Jonathan shows up at the house, uh, apparently uninvited to the part to the party. Uh, he's like, "Y'all having a party while me the baddest?" I don't know why everybody thinks they're the bad. Bitch. Never mind. Um, so I guess they like clearly we having a party without you. Um, sorry, I need to be able to see. Um, so. William decides to take, that's his cue to take his stuff up to Milan's room and start unpacking in his closet. So Milan comes upstairs, you know, he's like, I don't know what, um, um, the baby's gonna do. He goes up to him and he's like, look, I just don't want to let you know, I don't have an issue with you. I don't want no problems with you. You know, we cool. It'll be whatever. And he's like, what are you doing? Why are you in my room and stuff? And he's like, this ain't your room. This is my room now. What the Debo? What you mean? And apparently, um, Rio, he's sharing the room. Milan is sharing the room with Rio. And Rio was like, wait a minute. If Milan and I are in here, where Jonathan going to go? If Jonathan and Milan is in here, where I'm supposed to sleep at? That's not how this is going to work. And so... Um, Rio was immediately with the shits and starts taking off his stuff. And I'm like, ooh. Ooh. Well, Jesus, Father, God, in the name. So, they get into round one. First of all, Rio and Jonathan are not even in the same weight class. So, how they thought that was going to be alright, I do not know. But... They got into their first little tussle and security broke them up. And that's how the episode ended. It's the next episode. There's going to be cops, ambulances, chairs, fights. The whole nine. So, drama to ensue later. But that has been my review and recap of uh, Bad Boys LA. Season 1, episode number 8. A ball of confusion. Like, comment, and like the damn video. I feel that because I was mad aggressive. Hey, y'all, please like the video. Is that better? And I will catch you. What is that on my phone? Okay, I know what it is. Uh, and I'll catch y'all later for something.